Hey everybody, welcome back. I have a Dollar Tree how to do. I'm going to um, do it in two, break it up for two, because it's actually from four different Dollar Trees. My mother in law is bad for my addiction. I think we're all addicted to this store, but my mother in law is bad for this. She took me to two that I had never been to, and oh my god, the one was huge. You could put the one in that's in my store in it and the other one in, in the other county, Ashland, the one I had talked about I had went to with when I took my daughter. I think it was one of my first uh, Dollar Tree hauls, that one. And it, it was huge. But you could put those two in it. It it was huge. And one of the last few hours that we went to was the makeup and it, it had every makeup item that I had ever seen anybody ever haul on, on a Dollar Tree run. I, I swear I was just like, whoa, I blew my mind. <laughs> but, um, so I, I got a few things from there. And I've got a cute little story to tell you about that, but I wanted to show you one thing real quick and I'll tell you about that story. Um, remember me showing you, oh, dropped a flower. How, um, my mother in made those things with the towels. Well, she made two styles. The one, like I showed you with the kitty cat. And then she did this style. Um, where it, it can be a hand towel. But she crushes the border around it. But she takes a half a towel and, and does this. But I don't know if you're going to... I know it's covering me, so I can't really see. But uh, she does the border around all of it. To where, and, and the reason she did it this way for me was because she, bless her heart, she knows that um, I use towels um, for decoration for my centerpieces during holiday for holidays. So she did this, and she wouldn't take any money. Bless her little heart. <laughs> but um, it's the microfiber one, and I didn't know she could do it with that, and, and she did, and she matched that green perfectly, I think, and. So I told her to keep the other half for herself. So but I'm use that for my centerpiece for the Thanksgiving. Thanksgiving, good Lord, yeah. Mm -hmm. Jumping holidays for the um, St. Patrick's Day little centerpiece that I will do. And tomorrow I will um, show you my setup for that I had done for. And I leave it up even though Valentine's Day is on the 14th. I will leave it up the rest of the whole month just because that's just. You know, just because Valentine's Day is the 14th, it doesn't mean that you can't enjoy it the rest of the month. And, you know, I kind of go, it takes me a couple of days because I rearrange and change until I'm really satisfied. I'm, I'm picky. Um, I don't know why. It's really weird, you know. <laughs> but I like people to enjoy when they come by. And not everybody usually does that, you know, in the middle of winter, especially now with all this cold. But, so... Okay, and if you've been, I got the flower if I'm looking down. Let me get that and I will get started. Oh, you dropped two. <laughs> um, I don't know how loud the birds are going to be, so excuse me. Um, hoping I went ahead and celebrated Valentine's Day a little bit early. We um, got a gift certificate for Christmas from his sister and uh, hadn't had a chance to use it, so we kind of used it and, uh, which kind of helps. <laughs> and we went out for um, Valentine's Day dinner, which was nice. Um, we haven't been able to go out at all, really. But it was nice, just him and I, and he wasn't bothered with any car work, so I took it when I can get it, so it was nice. Um, these were, I, I got up at that, that store, and it's in Akron. Um, it went with my mother and I she had a doctor's appointment. And it was really bad out. I mean, really, really bad. And when we walked in, they, the manager, assistant manager, we got to draw up to two times. I think it's because it was so late in the day is the reason we got to draw up to twice. And you could use each little thing that you got, like so much off or a free item, whatnot like that. It was like a drawing. And uh, you could use it up to twice. And I don't know if it was because we were out of town or because it was so late in the day. They let us interchange. But I had won 50% off my order was one of them. I think the other one was like a free automotive thing or something, and, and I forget what my mother-in-law had gotten. But she 
lightly charged because she said they weren't as good as mine. So, needless to say, I got 50% off there. Um, I didn't give very much at all. I don't even think I spent uh, $10, which would have been 20 so I, I can't complain. But um, this was some of it, and I got a bunch of stickers that I hadn't seen. I mean, this store had... The Valentine section alone was like four aisles, up and down on both sides. And then the Easter was like six. And stickers, I, I'm not kidding you, they had fun, both sides. Two aisles of stickers. Uh, stickers. I didn't know there was so many stickers. I, I just shocked. I, I've never been in one that big. I thought the one I was in in the next county over, this is a county and a half over. Like it's like 40, 45 minutes depending on drive time over. The place is huge, and it's funny because I mean, my mother and I didn't know about this one. She thought it was a Dollar General at one point. It was a Rite Aid. They had changed, so it's amazing. But enough yet. And I, I just wanted to tell you that little story about. I kind of seem to somebody's always had bad luck all their life. It's kind of nice to have change of luck and even if it is a dollar tree it's kind of nice because you know you can see money it's always nice but this was one I had gotten and just a St. Patrick's on it I got these and even though there is just a little just enough glitter um I did spray them with some hairspray that I had gotten from the Dollar Tree um to keep it on there and then these ones is just called carnations. And the white with the green tipped ones. And it's got a little bit of green in with them, but the greenery, the bottom there. The other ones kind of didn't even show the, these ones, but um, nothing real special. But I liked them because. Um, now my Dollar Tree has these, but they're not, they're all smushed. Those weren't, so I, I, I was happy. And then these ones got just a little bit of glitter, and they're not, they're just tiny carnations. And then they actually have glitter on, on, the, on the little green leaves there. But, and it just says St. Patrick's, it's all, it says it doesn't have the name on it other than that. So. I kind of was playing with opening them up a little bit there. I kind of getting ahead of myself, I think. I mean, this one is, it's, it's another, um, just a hair, the green is just a hair, um, which this is the one, and then this is the other, and, and it's just hair. I don't know if you can... I'm not going <laughs> to do this. Here we go. Um, you know that? Can you... Yeah, it's just a hair different. It's, you're not picking it up on the camera, but it is different. And um, on your side by side, you can really see it, but it's just really hard to get it picked up on the camera here. And it just says carnation again. Um, this one has glitter on, on the carnations, but not on the, the, the leaves here. I'm so tired of seeing my poor, poor little nails and polish on them. I need to do them. There's no reason not to with over 200 polishes sitting in the cupboard or the drawers just sitting there. And this one is just some pretty green ones. Um, green is a favorite color of mine in purple, like I have said. Um, I just really like how full these ones are. You know, they're really quite full, as you can see. But, yeah, enough of those. <laughs> um, one second, I dropped one. I don't want it to get my book because it's got white on it. A little dusty this time of the year with my heater and kerosene. Um, okay, this stuff, I, I've got some makeup and like lotions and stuff that I will, will do the second part of the haul, but get going with this. Um, my 
so I hadn't got these in, but that I had seen. I may have gotten them in full out because I only go once a week for mine unless it's something I really need and can't wait for. Um, but I got the pink garbage can, which everybody has seen. And I got the blue. And I got the green. Um, I'm not sure if I'm going to use them for brushes. I thought about using one for my dirty brushes. You know, after I put them on for the day and then I clean them. Um, I'm not sure what else I, you know, I could save the pink one probably for my little niece when she comes over. But uh, we shall see. And then um, I showed you those boxes in my one haul, the, the little uh, green and blue boxes that I was going to try to make my homemade ring carriers in, holders. And if it failed, I would just use the boxes themselves for the holders. But I had gotten some felt. Um, there's a uh, blue, black, green, and red. Um, just your standard. There's 14 sheets, so there would what is three of each. Something like that. Three, six, nine, twelve. Well, not quite three, but you get what I mean. Get that. Um, but like I said, there's red, uh, green, blue, and black. But um. And I thought about using bubble wrap. You know, that kind of comes from the sake because that's the, the, the kind. And then, you know, just roll that up a little bit and then put this around it and make my own little. Trying to recycle. If it doesn't work, it doesn't work, but that's okay. And then, um, this kind of intrigued me just because it was a brand name. Um, if it doesn't work, it doesn't work. Um, I think it came out in in 2010, but um, I thought I'd give it a shot just because, you know, I'm always looking for different things for my kitchen, but it's the premium kitchen cloth, super absorbent, dries quickly, so super thirsty microfiber construction, and absorbs more than cotton dish cloth, rinses and rings easily, dries quickly, safe cloth for all surfaces. Caution, cloth itself does not scratch surfaces. However, it can pick up particles that do scratch. So, then I give it a shot. I really like the microfiber. Um, probably when he was working at Midas, that was one of the original ones that they had come out with that he had gotten from there. And I love that one. And I love all of them that we have gotten like that. So, I thought if anything else, that would be good to dry some dishes with, you know. And then I had gotten just the one candlestick and some candy dish. But being creative that I am not really, I'm good with the flower arrangements. But I wanted to do it like this. You see it with the glue gun. Because it's got this very selection to set my rings in and my jewelry when I take it off. Sometimes I this place or I'm really tired because I tend to leave all my jewelry on to, and my ear, earrings in until I come up and go to bed. I will take off my jewelry when I gather up my medicine for the night and take it downstairs with me because I take off my rings and stuff for I go do dishes and stuff. I figured sometimes I always put them away because I'd be asleep or something or my son is and I don't want to make a lot of noise so I just set them here. Sometimes they get misplaced or knocked off. Probably doesn't mean to but he sets his underwear and socks up here and he goes to gather them up they go flying so if I felt if I had a dish that was up a little bit I love that I don't like it like that it'd be a good candy dish either way just a little bit raised so two dollars if I don't like what I made I, I can't really be out a whole lot um envelopes we all know are expensive you just put the rent checks in for the young lady um Otherwise, I don't really, I have a, two bills of mail that I mail, that's it, but they have free envelopes, so just do that for the landlady and whatnot around the house. Um, like I said, these are from four different trips to one, two, two different Dollar Trees, like I said, I'd never been to, and then mine that I'd went to two different times, so it's four different trips. This isn't all from one, but by any means, because I ain't got that kind of money, you know, it just doesn't work that way. 
And I did have some coupons for, for some things. Um, I haven't come across any yet, but I'm getting ready to. I had 75 cents off on two Scotch Bite, so that was 35 cents off each. Something like that, I think. So I found two of these actually at mine. I wish the coupons had come out when I was at the other Dollar Tree because they had the actual green scratchies. But these are the blue ones. They're not really, they're the non-scratchy, but you find a deal like that and it's good sponge and they don't separate. So I got two of these. And these are, that was at my Dollar Tree. I found two of these. And it's the real sponge and these don't separate. At another dollar one, Dollar Tree obviously. And I found this one at another one. So, and these ones don't separate. So I, I got these. And these little glass bowls I've never seen before. At least at mine. So I got two of them. Um, they say they're dishwater safe. Is that it? Microwavable, dishwasher safe, freezer safe, oven safe, top uh, lid rack dishwasher safe. So I, I know they were supposed to be compared to Pyrex, so I got two of them. I guess my mother in law had found some, one of the other ones that she had taken me to. I so, oh, wish I would have known. Because she she'd have different sizes, so I would have picked them up. But I got the only two I'd seen. So I picked them up. And this is the two cups size, so I got two of them. And uh, with the new laptop that I have, uh, which that's what I'm using, I wouldn't be able to uh, harass you guys <laughs> with my videos. Um, I had a pair of, of one of my favorite earplugs, you know, to, to listen to with my old laptop that could put it on us, um, which we had bought off my sister-in-law, and it finally could put it but she'd used it all through college, so it was an older one. Um, couldn't use it with this one. They were, I be found them in a car, so. Um, they were old, I don't know how old, but they were great, I love them. I love how they sit in my ear. And I'm just having a hard time finding another pair that fits comfortably in my ear. Um, these were just too cute, they're animal print. The glare. But they're just too cute, it's got the, the pink and white on the black there. I just thought they were too cute. I have a red pair that's on a real thin split, you know, uh, the wire that you split. These ones are already split, but you split it. And I liked that style because it was a real thin wire that kind of just split, but they just don't set too good. And when I'm sitting up here in bed and he's sleeping, and the light doesn't tolerate him, so I can turn down the, the light on the computer here, but, you know, I put my earbuds in to, to be respectful so I can still hear and uh, I have a really hard time like I said I'm being in for any length of time even more than just a couple of minutes so they say lightweight and comfortable we shall see um, I haven't bought a pair yet that I that haven't worked that's not the issue it's been sitting in my ears so. and um, I guess I'm a little girl at heart but I just, these were cute. I didn't have any per se like this one. I have some that were smaller, but not quite like this. So I had picked these up. And then this I've seen on TV, microfiber magic sponge. So I had this is this on the one side and then this on the other. Super durable. Uh, use over and over. Dishwasher safe. Clean better, faster. Easier without chemicals. Grime buster side is the blue and light blue stripes. Soft side for quick cleanups and sparkling shine is this side. So, two for a buck either way if all else fails is just a dish sponge. And that's not bad because something similar to this Walmart I carried and I did like them. Except they were had bad habit when you'd buy them, they'd be ripped already. And you think you'd chuck them and you'd find them. And for the price I was paying, you know, a little over two bucks for them, like, just was getting to be. And then they raised them, and I thought I ain't paying any more than that for them, a little over two. And then they raised them like a whole dollar, and I thought, oh, forget it. So if all else fails, and they don't end up being as good as they say, they're still good to sponge stuff. And then I had gotten two of these cups for the bathroom. Um, 
Say so you get 48. That's 2 for 98. 96. Oh, 98, duh. <laughs> Super 98. When Walmart sells them, mm, choose something for for 100. So the same size, I think. So it, 150, something like that. I, I, well, but Walmart kept changing the sizes that they were carrying. So I don't think this is a bad deal as far as you know the quantity and the price for what the sizes that you get and you know but I did get two of them and they're sturdy I, I haven't had a problem with with them you know I don't know if anybody else has but I personally haven't got any bad ones and then I did get those coffee mugs with the lids the, the 16 20 20 ounce ones mine had never had them the one we had went to I got hit a whole shelf full. I mean, a whole big shelf full. I got six of them. And then, you know, the next trip when I went to my Dollar Tree, they had some. Of course, if I hadn't gotten them, mine wouldn't have had them. But I forgot to bring them upstairs. They're, they're downstairs. But I had them in my one video, and it's it's a staple when I go. Um, I try, now that I've got got them on hand, I try not to let myself get to a certain level. My mother-in-law said that um, since we have to, we'll, we'll make a run so that I don't run out. Nice of her. <laughs> um, and then um, I hadn't seen this at mine. Mine still hadn't got these in. But I got the shamrock one. I just thought it was too cute. Um, the scarf. I, I do like these. You, you can, well, I got my Valentine Day one on now just because we went out to eat and I have brown on. But I actually got a couple of compliments today with the couple of errands I had to run and out to eat. So I like them. I don't know about anybody else. I'd be curious to know if anybody else likes them, but they're nice, I think. And I like my Christmas one I had gotten, and, and I like these, too. So. And then I had gotten two of the, the Fabuloso, if I'm pronouncing it right, um, with bleach alternative. And it doesn't smell like bleach. No, I couldn't get it because I am allergic to bleach. It does flare up my asthma majorly. Um... Normally this stuff I kind of keep on hand. Um, I can't like to keep on downstairs because I use it for hubby's work clothes if i got to wash his work uniforms because he by chance forget or certain clothes that the guys use to work in that I have to wash separately. But this scent, I really like the smell. I think I'm going to dilute like it says to do and for the spray bottle and use for cleaning around the house and stuff because I really do like the smell. It, it's really nice. Usually I just buy the spick and span or stuff like that. Dollar Tree, but it's big. Certain things are cheap at Walmart, and certain things you can't get at Walmart. You have to get at Dollar Tree. You guys know how that goes. But this really smells nice. I don't know if all Dollar Trees carry them. <laughs> um, this one I didn't find at mine. I found it at another one. But I did get two of that. And I wanted to try this just for it's portable hanging file storage box, but um, not for file storage, but for just storage in general. Um, I don't know if that picture is going to show up for what it is. Let's see. This thing right there. That's what I got. But I wanted to, because it looks like the top just sets on it. It folds over it like um, the cigar box folds down. Um, I got it for storage purposes for, for things. Um, all else, well, I kind of thought for my little back stock of a. Uh, the makeup that I have, the little bit of, of powders and stuff that I, I've got it in a basket, but I don't want to get it dusty, so I kind of thought that would work. And then I had gotten, almost done here and probably done, <laughs> then I'll go on to part two. Um, this is three file folders. I like them because they're flowers, and um, it's that time of the year I need I need my own ice for my things that I do. So, um, but they're flowers. I thought that was cute. 
my altar like that, so I thought that was neat. And I got green, yellow, and pink folders. And you can find three for a buck when it's non-school. Uh, that's pretty good. I always seem to need any his hubby does. He only needed one or two. So I, I need the other one. It's non-school. It's pretty good to find them that way. And I found three of these so that they are homemade note cards. I always like to have cards on hand, cards that I can write in, or cards that say how I feel. So these are just too cute. Um, you can see how that's raised. This one is right here. Um, but they're just little flowers, and they're just too cute. That glare. There we go, and you got like, it looks like a little sparkly. And the flower. Oh. <laughs> here, there. They're just too cute. The whole flower is raised. And this is pink. It's just too cute. Look at that little heart right there. And there's six in each one. So. Yeah. So. And uh, these were at that, that big dollar tree. One of those dollar trees. How did I say it? Guys, I'm sorry. I'm just like a butt. <laughs> it's silly. And the middle. It's a bell. And it says tweet. It's the middle one that's raised. And yeah. There you can see. That is too cute. Too cute. Um, so I've done the folders. I'm sorry. I have one of these already, but it was just too cute. I got another one. Um, I also keep out of our book section. I write down the books that I've read, so I don't go back to reread them. And then some of them. Um, so that way I don't repurchase them at like rummage sales. Uh, the library, you know, has their, their uh, yearly book thingy that they do. Um, it's not the library does it, but it's um, the Kiwani, I think, does it through the library. And then um, the end of the, the last day of the sale, they have the $5 bag, uh, brown bag sale. And then I, I write down what books that we already have, so I carry it with me, but I, so I keep it in, in, in one of those folders. I got this one too because the polka dots are just too cute too. But uh, I needed one to store my um, papers in when they were opened. That's why I got that one. But um, I thought this was just too cute with the little. Yes. Print. Little print. This is black and pink. And none of these I found at mine. And this one is um, black with some kind of um, like feathery, it's like a feathery design scroll work. I don't know how well that's gonna. A little bit. It's really a pretty. I liked it. I like to write notes on it. Not only send things and just in general to write on. All right. And we're gonna show my stickers and I'll be done. Oh no. And then this cute little tape, you know, for gift mailer or whatever. Um, that's what it looks like there. It's too cute because I got some butterfly some at one point, and when I got that, but it's just, um, it is purple and a teal, baby blue teal color. And it's really pretty. Cause I like the purple. That's why I got it. And I have never seen these stickers here. These are, um, let's stick these right here. These are raised. Um, they're called pop-up ones. This is flowers and butterflies. Of course, roses are my favorite flower, and I love butterflies. And, and you can get flowers and butterflies, roses and butterflies are the same thing, you know, it's kind of cool. But, uh, it's really neat because you can see how they're raised a little bit. Right, yeah, a little bit. So yeah, I kind of like that. This is just all butterflies. <laughs> and butterflies are so, that one's adorable.
These are beautiful creatures. This one was just girly. <laughs> Kind of off center there, sorry guys. A little denim in pink. Just too cute. Um, um, this one doesn't say how many. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. This one's just eight. This one just had eight, the, the girly one. And this one is 15. And they're kind of, um, they're called uh, chipboard embellishments. They got little gems on the butterflies, as you can see down here. Down here. And this is 42. The flowers, little laser. And there's some more butterflies. I don't have any quite like this one. I, I've got had different butterflies, but not quite like this, and that's why I got them. I can say that I haven't had the same stickers twice, which has been nice. And, and these are even different still yet than what I have bought, so it, it's nice. Try not to get that glare, guys. I try changing the light bulb, but it doesn't help. Actually, it makes it really, really dark in here, and I'm, I'm sorry. Okay, three more on the Valentine, and I'll be done <laughs> with this video. I mean, these are all different than the ones I bought in before. And I know Valentine's Day will be here and gone, but, you know, that's okay. These are 50. The, the last set of flowers were 50, the butterflies were 34. These are all 50 valentines. I just think it's so cute how it's kind of like a patchwork in there. But you know, those days, and there's nothing wrong with using hearts all year long on occasion, I don't think. And here's like the lasered. I got similar, but not exactly like this. So, like I said, I had gotten 50% off on, on all these stickers over from the one location, so. Well, I thank you guys. Um, let me know if there was anything that you guys have already purchased and this was my first time seeing it all. I'd be curious to know what you guys have gotten. Um, I'd like to know. Um, thank you so much for watching. Thank you to the people who have subscribed. Thank you all for sticking around. I, I appreciate it very much. Everybody stay blessed. I hope I made you smile. Any questions, just ask. And hopefully I didn't bore you too much. <laughs> um, I will get off here and I will do part two. And thanks for watching as always. Thank you. Take care, everybody. Bye-bye.